right, karibu sana. Welcome back. This is still why in the morning and you're hanging out with me, Brian Sako. Now, to go to Mekuliza Suali, katika social media. Uh, let me get it, let me get it. In men's conference, Mona resolutions a men's conference who has a dumo. I will sample your feedback. And uh, joining us live in studio, of course, Keshoni Valentine's, whether we have amazing surprises for you i swear to god you will like it you will like it tomorrow i swear to god you will love it kesha so stay tuned to y254 channel i'm joined by yama the poet uh, karibu sana brother uh, thank you very much and then there's edwin saningo yes all right welcome so uh let me start with you edu uh when it comes to valentine's day kuna kuanga nile facade ama kuna kuanga nile narrative like uh it's always men who are ni my baby girls too want to treatment oh my goodness i'm losing my voice my baby girls want to treatment but then my baby boys lazima lazima upeleke mtu yeah. out hata kama itabidi ukope now when it comes to men's conference i remember those at time ili organizeo kasema all men watend wa hang out mali and then watarudi after valentine day in maisha mm. but then bone jai happen ama ni kitu tu inasema na si ukweli uh, <coughs> in my opinion naza sema clearly <coughs> tumekuwa tukizungushwa about the men's conference thing because uh, kwa aspect ya valentines you know valentines day uh, i just say specifically like it's a girl to take out day right. it's something mutual ni uh, the the couple the two of them wanna go somewhere they have dinner and or whatever right. but how to me fanya ikakuwa we have made it about uh, girls like the female aspect sasa how they are, are the one who are supposed to, to receive the treatment okay. the boys are the one who are to give the treatment yeah but anyway generally na fa kwa but do you feel like uh, squeeze to nashi kwa world where men can also be taken out by women clearly uh, yeah. would you feel guilty if you were taken out by a woman on a date akueleke ku treat akulipia blah 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 and the rest of the whole date shibang will you feel guilty mtu kwa tu sawa you be like hey i'm getting it right honestly nda kwa sawa lakini pia ndaangalia eh as a man napelekwa dena jo tuko na hiyo mentality as a man wendo nafaku kupelekana out na ku, ku treat the lady but okay. mimi nike nikezoleza opinion uh, mimi mwenyewe naweza sema yeah it's, it's a good thing it's okay See, i don't mind ku, okay. kupeleka out na the the girl okay yeah. uh, let me come to you uh, my poetry guy yes. uh, <laughs> adi kwa uh, i'm sure kuna ma poets ma poems ushai tungia madam yeah. kama mbe hii nitakuimbia siku ya valentines day Ume, umepanga kitu ya kuimbia yeah, bebika siku ya valentines day kitu iko yeah. yeah okay nice fantastic now when it comes to men's conference uh, siju kama ushai attend moja ushai attend moja ama unaisikianga tu social media uh, for the last year on 14th february 2021 i was to attend Uh-huh. but i was broken down what happened by a lady you know valentine is all about uh, love okay so i was by that time i was in university and my okay. girlfriend by then by then was still at home okay so i traveled from university back home i did my shopping i did my car and my flowers whatever a lady needs by then mm-hmm. i traveled with it back home so that i can maybe surprise her show right. that i love her uh-huh. but my surprise when i reached home we were supposed to meet at a certain restaurant so that we can interact talk more and discuss maybe our love issues and plan for the future but when we met by then we were dis- I was very much uh, disappointed to meet her with another man wow like it was just like what what has happened to me like you are you are loving someone who is loving another person in a different way mm. so i was really okay. broken until uh, i don't really attend them in case they are <laughs> they are taking place but uh, Mm-hmm. Men's conference according to me they are very good occasions okay. that should be that should talk about how men should treat their wives or their girlfriends or their lovers and we should discuss as men things that we should do so that we bring our marriages to the correct way okay. and so that we can plan for the future relations. I like that last part. Things that we need to discuss as men to ensure that we bring relationships ziko yeah. fit. Yeah. Now, uh quiz men's conference. <laughs> What do you think of ni vitu gani wase uongelea? a boys who can meet go easy conferences just in case maybe is it a happen i mean because nimeona there's one that has been advertised this one is real it's professional though yeah. what do you think some of the things who are on ngela kufika comments conference zenye maybe ukitoka huko ukiattend ukirudi utatreat them wako differently ama utakuwa melani mekuchange hata mindset pia 
you know, it depends with the person organizing and the people who are attending. Some just organize maybe, you know, women like football, there are things that we discuss as men. So some of us, we just discuss that we can talk about football so that we can, tar we can interact, we can do networking. Mm -hmm. But so it depends on the person who, who is organizing. So if the okay. person organizing is talking about maybe relationship, basically we shall talk about how we can restore our relationships into, into a correct way. Okay. So that uh, in, in this maybe conference, we can mm -hmm. talk about things that we can do back home with our wives or things that we can do in our lives or okay. that to maintain that contact with our, with our wives so that we may not have things such as uh, divorce, or okay. maybe fights in our relationship, you know. All so right. whatever we should do is that, uh, you know, in men's conference they discuss an idea, for example, we can discuss an idea that uh, when a man tells you that uh, he'll be home by maybe 7 p.m. and maybe arrives two hours late, as right. a woman, what you are supposed to do? Or right. as a man, what does it mean to your relationship? Okay. So we discuss real resolutions or the ideas or the things that we should do in our relationship so that uh, we should maintain the contact or maintain the good relationship with our wives or with our lovers. All right, yeah. Mr. Yama, the poet, I love that. Yeah. Now, let me come back to you, Edu. Yeah. What should we expect tomorrow from the baby boys? I'm a boy child. I know, but by the way, kuna National Prayer Day, Ikopale Nyayo Stadium. Minta kuna represent Y244. Minta and Apo Kuombea Station, Kuombea Kilamtu, Imuaka Mgo Mkumbuke. But na Jopini siku ya Valentine's Day. So, Come out and I'm going to me email. But Edu, what should we expect tomorrow? Tomorrow is here. Finally, the day we have been waiting for is finally here. What uh, expect Nini? Uh, first of all, we have seen tomorrow the hype has been building up around uh, tomorrow. Yeah. And uh, Sasa Nikesho, it's, uh, it's tomorrow. And uh, the hype, we all hope that we live up to the hype, right? Okay. So, uh, now on the theme of tomorrow, like people will be so jovial, uh, people will be doing the most, you know. We are seeing people going to like, uh, they're just trying to do their best to treat their spouse as well and uh, their wives, their girlfriends in the best the way they can. Because, right. you know, Valentine's is usually different for the couple. You may find some, uh, for some couple, maybe tomorrow they are marking maybe something, their fourth anniversary or something, an anniversary they're celebrating it. And coincidentally, yeah. it's on Valentine's Day. You see, right. it adds some extra spice to the, to the yeah. day. Right, so true. I'm seeing that every couple or every uh, couple out there, right. they are celebrating Valentine's in a different way. And that's what makes it different from maybe last day. Because I feel like this year, the hype in is really there. Hype uh, sana hype sana. All right, yeah. it's okay. Uh, and speaking of uh, hype as well as Kupele come to out, what are some, what are some of the ways uh, that... Uh, the, ba the, the baby girls should be treated. Amam to a kitaka kutritiwa, especially boy child kitaka kutrit baby girl. Mm. What are some of the things are fanya kesho? Like, us pofanya is a kesho, yeah. but they how to come and treat you up their Valentine's from yeah. you. Uh, from my perspective, kitu ya kwanza ni, always have a surprise. Kwa na kitu, yeah. enyo me, ye mwenye hajui. She knows yeah. the basic thing which is, ni kesho, maybe they are heading out somewhere. You need to hide all the details to how we're going to spend, you know, your, the curiosity is what makes it more interesting. Okay. So you, you need to hide the details of how you're going to spend the day, where you're going. Akikuuliza yeah. nako so insistent, even lie about the location, just say ni hapa. Yeah. Adika unasema, uh, eh, mi adi sena pesa minge, hopu ko okay, tukienda hapa. Adi anaka, mm -hmm. ah, it's okay. Lakini kumbe, umeko kiplan something big for her, na unajua yeah. how important it is for her. Because yeah. to me notice, Madam, be this squeezy. Yeah. Wana sema, it's not about what when you tambaya. It's the truth of it that matters. It always matters. The thought that uli uli kau kasa mota pele kahapa, it was Being really matters. Yeah. You know. eh, sasa ndo na ona niki sema, uh, you need to hide the details of where you're going. Do equal like a surprise. You need to have a surprise for her. Yeah. Another thing, uh, unafa kum ku nesema ku purchase something or kumpea something and yeta mark uh, today, like uh, the Valentine's Day itself. Right. Like, you know, maybe we may spend the day in a restaurant. Now, you reveal something like just like a say, maybe we to something like a, a really pretty necklace or right. just something special, unique, its own way. Now, Pia, right. kitu buy like mm -hmm. ana atakuwa poor now, like you do you need girlfriend yako or your wife. So, kinunua, nunua kitu ita, ita mbamba. Pia, you know, something as a quite disappointed, but Pia, right. the girl herself, should not act like at a member because it's a good day, everything is going well. So uh -huh. ata, she'll hide it. So I think okay. those are the things that uh, as a man, kesho, nafako umiji, umiji amina, tukama hizo. 
Okay, yes. I like that. Mm. Yes. What are some of the things Buichad and Afaq fanya kesho? Unajua kesho ni ile wanasema we are going to celebrate love. Mm-hmm. You know, boy shall pia si lazima uingie kwa expenses zenye wise manager like just my brother said here. Okay. So whatever you should do make sure it's in your capabilities. Like I was reading some tweets back days. I I read where by a boy took a her lady into a, a certain restaurant and the lady ordered some expensive things that the lady could not afford. The man. Yeah, the man could not afford. Her. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So inge bidum um um chana akatoka so bili kabaki kwa mwana ume kabidi sana amefanya tukazi pale ndio amechonga viazi ndio hiyo bili kwa recovered but in the meantime we should know we should what as men ama as a boy child or as a person in a relationship make, make sure when you are doing something do something that make sure you can afford to do it kama vile okay. amesema usifanye kitu ambacho haiko haiko kwa uwezo wako no. or maybe you can just surprise surprise her by visiting her randomly without and in, without telling her or maybe yeah. taking her place you can take her to a museum take her yeah. take to a seaport maybe you can swim or just enjoy it's not okay. all about spending time chatting about the love for the past year and mm-hmm. it's also good for this time for valentine to plan for whatever you are expecting this all year 2023 okay planning for whatever you should do or your aspirations as your love make sure you maybe you're planning to open a business maybe you're planning for a wedding maybe you're planning for more so you, this is the best time for you as two couples to make sure you plan whatever you should do for the ne- for the next 12 months or the next few months ahead all right i've, I've remembered this story of kevin boy i learned sub- sub- surprise like yeah. say, what if you surprise me to say me umeenda na akona mtu mwingine kwa date ama akona plans zingine wewe wewe me surprise na chihuahua i'm me surprise na snack pet i'm like bad he's a you know surprise zingine lazima concern yeah. lakini you know when is a surprise mtu na gari kumbe alikuwa anataka ndege you know first of all it really hurts unaenda ku surprise mtu unapata kumbe akwa relationship nyingine from my experience i really mm-hmm. passed yeah. i passed through it so that umefanya shopping yako vizuri you have planned about that day schedule iko full but right. kufika unapata you have really surprised it's just mingo wendo sasa unakuwa surprised in fact unakuwa surprised tulikuwa na form surprise so the wendo una surprise unakuwa surprise it really hurts by the way mm. yeah Okay uh heartbreak I'm sure after <laughs> after, after Valentine's yeah. Day I'm sure more uh towards end of Feb as well because Feb actually they shot next week but one yeah. March up on the <laughs> I was in a fake relationship all oh, this was just a game all oh, this was not a serious thing it was just they call it uh, what is the what is the name what is the name of that thing that people just hook up once it was just a fling you know oh, they fling. call it a fling yeah. so oh, do you feel like he mwaka kunaenda kwa na heartbreaks mingi unajiona semanga it will end up in premium tears okay. it was all lovey dovey and then it finally ends up in premium tears uh it has been there uh previously unapata before unajua sab, kuna some other ladies wanaitumia for advantage unapata maybe hii ni valentines yangu ya kwanza na mm. demnongea na yeye anaambia watu wengine huko yeye anampeleka valentines but after hapo I'm not seeing anything between us but mm. acha nenene valentines ni see how it treats yeah. me and then after apo ya to me just, yeah uh, yeah anaweza yeah. 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 valentines yake wa kwanza you really want to go all out so Wanaka, you're genuine eh, you're genuine okay. you're seeing something happening afterwards not just one day event and then it all goes to normal right so <clears throat> as I advise those people out there wenye hii yako ya kwanza and uh, una feel uko na that pressure na sasa matu just relax just do you just the way you planned to do it don't start or start referring to how people other people are doing it just do yeah. the way you wanted to do it if you are thinking uh maybe you could just go to a park and just walk you know valentines are uh, there's no rule that said valentines you should go to a hotel you should yeah. go to a cinema or something okay, valentines is all about spending time with your loved one right yeah. is so, it always a romantic partner i'm a relationship partner i'm no. a Uh, I'd like to hear your insights on that. Lazima yeah. ukiwa mtu mnapendana romantically yeah. ama pia inaweza kuwa like something else. Ah uh, si lazima ikuwe by love that because personally I did last year. Yeah. Uh, when I went to Valley, I didn't go because I, I didn't go uh, I, I was not dating so we just went with our with our friends. Okay. It doesn't mean like you have to uh, your partner it's not your partner. You can just go to even you see adi kuna watu group, group of yeah. friends right? Mm-hmm. I don't know yeah. pata watu wameenda like come say my ac kesho tu twende tu we just do something uh, to jibam eh, to jibam uh, it's not i could say my peer to me love one wife lover eh watu wapatana tu tunasema twende hapa we just enjoy ourselves to say right. today it was a day well spent right yeah 
Yes. First of all, talking of heartbreaks, you know, in fact, from not even next month, from just tomorrow evening or tomorrow morning, there are many Kenyans who yeah. will be really heartbroken. Right. Like, we couldn't expect, for example, ni kupigia simu ni kuambia na kupeleka out, but no call. Unangalia kwa status, ni mepost mtu mgine tofauti. Ama opost chochote. Ama si post. Na ukomteja. Na ukomteja. So, from tomorrow, Alright. Watu atakuwa na lia, wengine atakuwa na furaia. So we are going to have a confused emotions. Right. It depends on the person in yeme mfikia a, a cocktail of emotions. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. So several people will be heartbroken because maybe mekuwa mkuna juu nizakuwa na fikiri ya mtu fulani mna date na hee kumbe ya na kuchukulia kama bestie. Oh, mm, bestie, yeah. bestie, chubu. <laughs> okay. So mna zafikiri ya mna date na mtu kumbe ya it was just a, a long con. You have just been playing a game, playing a game. Mna zafikiri you are in a very serious relationship. Kufika siku ya kesho unapata ame post. Kumbe you are on your own. Eh, wameenda tena ku interact. You yeah. are on your own now. So, All then right. we are going to have several heartbreaks because uh, we, in fact, the relationship we are by university relationships. Uh, when you talk about campus relationship, we are going to receive to receive many many heartbreaks. Kuna wengine hata utapata. Inaenda kwa hapa nje. Is it because the ladies in campus are dating people outside campus who are working ama what is happening? Yeah, the thing is you talk about now your pocket mfuko yako sasa. Ah, okay. If you cannot afford me, then yeah. let me look for someone who oh, may be afford uh, my needs, yeah. my values, you know, how yeah. much I'm worth, yeah. lifestyle yango. Oh, okay. Then kuna wale maboys pia wako too outdated. They don't care about Valentine. All na unapata right. na date msichana mwenye ako juu anata, anataka Valentine na peluke mahali ya kwe surprise ta mm -hmm. So inabidi kwa relationship kama yu msichana amenda kutafuta another man outside to yeah. surprise him and to make mm -hmm. him feel good. Whatever we are talking about is just love. Yeah. And what, what one has love Monique was so expensive, Vivo. I'm not saying that. <laughs> I'm not saying anything. <laughs> but Bona it was so expensive, Vivo. And then he siku the next day mna chukiano na block ata mm. post him to mgini. Bona it happened, Vivo. I thought it should be that like that na ikwe like forever, happily ever after. You know, it's just temporary. Like it's only Tuesday after hapo kila mtu wa merudi back. You know. You know, I'm a poet, and in poetry we say, love. Nobody understand loves. Okay. Nobody can understand love. Love uh -huh. is just a feeling that we feel it. Okay. You can feel it now. Love can be, can be created, then it grows, then love dies. Oh. For example, if you meet your friend for the first time, maybe a lady, she'll be your crush. There you'll start uh -huh. creating a relationship. Now you are creating love. Mm -hmm. If you fall in love, maybe you are, the relationship is strong. Now love starts growing. Right. Then you reach a point where but you don't care for each other. Maybe you are now married. Everybody's looking for money. There are students who are school. Now the mm. pe ev in that house, everybody's just busy. Okay. Now love starts dying. Inanza kufed. Inanza kufed. The spark dies. Kitu like kama they say. Uh, kitu kama <laughs> Valentine. Sona pata mchukuli serious. Kwa Valentine, watu wanaenda job. Okay. Kwa nyumba, unatoka asubu, unaenda job. Mke pia, unaenda job. Right. Then love but, dies. But I feel like that's a mature, that's a mature union. Yeah. Uh, I believe on you to like uh, 35, 40, you know, because yeah. I believe on you to uh, mature, like they've gone through all the stages of life on a jewel. This was infatuation, this was just an excitement, and now this is real life with real life crisis yeah. and responsibilities. All right, uh, Edu, uh, okay. those are, those are, those are, those are memes that viral on Twitter. Na pia ilikuwa shared social media in general. There was this chat ilikiwa ya mtu alikuwa na chat na dem. And then all of a sudden anatafuta tu makosa ya kumkasirikia. Mbona unataipa raka leo? Mbona mbona umedelay in two seconds mbona? So that kesho achane na ni yu dem anasema hivyo. Are there people maybe wanatafuta two reason? Maybe avoid mtu kesho ndo asimpeleke out ama avoid your cost and then finally whatever their way of making up. Eh. Mimi nasema uh, for other people in as a code to genuine and honor uh, there's no need me to go out of my way and uh, I'm I'm going to be the one who ends up suffering All and right. then at the same time you don't want to disappoint her right. so that's where the excuses come in okay excuses zina it's excuses that they are being made in that situation. Then you got petty. Yes, like, why are you breathing fast today? <laughs> why are you typing? I'm yeah. used for you to reply after 10 minutes. Mona yeah. Leona reply yeah. in two yeah. seconds. Yeah. You know? So, Donna, so, you excuse in a come in that moment in order to buy time. You can focus on yourself. You can say, hey, Kesho, you can say, and then 
I have nothing else left. Nikisema ni kesho eh kesho sema eh nikijituma kesho ni nifanye hii na hii. I'm looking at the future what will I have in the end and maybe vitu kwa tunasema alia maybe old homes chana atakuwa tu ana anatumia kesho and then it's all done. Aje pia lazima put that into consideration. Yeah. So I think that uh, for other people atakuwa ai kesho acha tu mimi ni nijifiche kwanza and then afterwards I come and say Ah, jana tukoenda but you unaonaje tukenda mm. to compensate for maybe the other week because something happened so that pet is kuzenye utakuja nao whichever it is to utakuja sema sasa can we go somewhere and uh, just redo all this yeah yeah now kwa do, do you feel like anyone manyana that could have valentines kesho mm. they're going to spend financially and definitely before end of feb or the core broke kwa wale hawana budget like to say to kesho kama hauna budget then you are in trouble yeah. like forget an amazing valentines in yeah. short kesho you must spend money that you've not been spending in january mm. and even in the beginning of feb yeah mixo mkweli that's inevitable we if you think you're going to spend as little as possible you're very wrong because ado unajua hata kama unasema hata kama useme this kitu nasemanga ni hata kama sema ume, ume budget uh, plan ume, ume plan budget ya kesho nasema eh hey, kesho najua says exceed maybe Those something like yeah six mm. started out okay. yeah. but, uh, but then if you're spending 6k 10k 20k it means you are also on a salary yeah. on a salary or you have savings or you have a business mm. or you've been saving for these yeah. since last year or maybe in january yeah. right yeah mm. Right. Okay, continue. So, ndo na feel kama unasema ukume plan budget, me can tell you right now things tomorrow may not go as planned. Okay. So because unafika hapo unasema ni hii and then we could tunasema tu um sana maybe an editor something. Uko eh. Yeah. I did I didn't expect that editor kitu kai. You see, now But mbona usimwambie tu hey manzea <laughs> we'll not have sushi. We're not going to eat Japanese whatever or Japanese blah 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 si please let's just eat ugali mayai and we go mbona usimwambie hivyo mimi no na uwezi kwa sababu wanataka ku impress unaona una ukitaka ku impress you can't start a saying out of your way. Eh, mm. because at okay. she had expectations mm. that right. she's going to Be it's about her yeah, yeah so it's about, about her and then you start say unaanza kurudi nyuma na sema eh si tuitishe hii eh uh-huh. ukianza saa ku umefika hapo dem ataanza kwa ah, I knew maybe I could have come to this one I go to that that other person. But on is on is a kubali like yeah, yeah. instead of eating sushi less mm. it's pizza you know. But that's a one in a million chance utapata msichana na kubali kitu kama hiyo. I can understand it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay in short they are demanding. Mm. Very demanding. Okay so kama una pesa forget. <laughs> <laughs> Now talking about uh, we talked about uh, first of all the impression the impression that we are going to give these ladies first of all kesho the president has announced that we are going to have prayers national prayer day service. yeah national and prayer day. Represents. <laughs> so ukiangalia sasa hii kuna wanaume wanasema god first meaning yeah, god first wanasema okay. kesho washa schedule siku tunaenda kuomba maana na valentine wako ndani but do you feel like kuna wale watatumia hiyo siku ku escape history of valentine yeah <laughs> kuna wengi wengi wanasema we are going to pray for this nation we have been having drought, drought. we have been Akuna having bandits four. So yeah. we must pray for Security. this nation. Relationships are fought about die. Yeah, after tumeomba. Uh, another thing they are going to use excuse ya mpira. Yeah. They are going to say we are going to watch football during Kesho this time. Kesho kuna EPL kwa ni? Champions EPL League. Game. Champions League. Yeah. Okay. So they are going to use that time to maybe say we are they are going to create lame excuses. Hata msichana mwenye akiangalia anajua tu huyu huyu hapa ameruka. Ziko wale. Zingine yeah. zinakaa tu. <laughs> Zingine zinakaa tu. Then talking okay. about uh, expenditure. Yeah. We are first of all we started by talking about make sure whatever you are or your restaurant you are going it go, ina, yeah, inaendana na mfuko wako. Ama kulikuwa na mtu alikuwa anasema hebu kila kama una, unaendanga kwa ma restaurants Nairobi kwa mabeshte na mawaita so wote kwenye unaenda kuitisha pombe. <laughs> no time never it is really expensive. Urambi wait and change and let it yeah. cheap and you know for and I'm going to pay bill card kuna wengine wana ile mekupea hapa kuna wengine wanaenda previsit leo exactly wanaenda kusema kesho nakuja na mrembo this is what will present at my table <laughs> tulete hii na, na usiongeze nyingine because yeah. ukiongeza wewe ndio utalipa sasa amo aseme akitisha hii mwambie haiko 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 ama imeishi ama ina ndo usiko ama leta which is a good hat boy child it's a good idea bwana eh all right
<laughs> so people are going to create excuses. Then you are to make sure that come and spend a spend sana. Yeah. But uh, the thing is, we are trying to impress this lady to show that we love them. Uh -huh. Other things that kuna wale wanafanya kazi kwanza kesho ni katika tia mwezi wanaenda kuomba advance the so that they are, they are spending their maximum salary to make sure that this lady is embraced this lady is smart make sure that um, um sana endelea kumpenda but later unaweza pata wana regret unasema oh it was just a long con yeah. um mrembo kumba nipendi so make yeah. sure what yeah whatever whatever you are going to do tomorrow make sure it's a, it's iko okay. kwa mkono yako make sure unafanya kitu ambacho una, unawezeshewa okay. usifanye kitu ambacho I, uh, bills na kuja bills ngine mingi kesho inaisha yes, una, unaingia kwa madeni <laughs> na mekula <laughs> only pizza eh, mta na nachukua loan anasema kesho anachukua loan ya 10k right. anasema to go on a date yeah. and on that note let me sample your feedback first and first because you are out of time uh, Kalea Clinton anasema we can't live without this Jezebel daughters hey but the question is men's conference mbona resolutions the men's conference who has it do Kalea Clinton, eh bwana, sawa tu. Okay. Rod Derrick anasema kwani kuna shida. OG wa kasa anasema ukitoa point ina make sense unapewa remis moja. Hey bro. <laughs> and then Jerry Kimani anasema sababu it doesn't exist in the first place. Andrew Nyangi anasema in every successful idea there's a woman. Do you see any woman in that conference? Kichwa bila shingo. I see you. I see you. I see you. And then uh, there's Kibe Kituro anasema kama gani hiyo? Okay, and then we had asked you a question also, it's about World Radio Day. Who's your favorite radio presenter in Kenya and why? Mgena nasema, shut up, Dishabelo nasema, locked out of Kirinyaga Massive. Uh, Lewis Tezu nasema, Ziza Hashem. Uh, Becky Camilo nasema, locked in from Rai. Hey, mgena nasema, Tuwongo, it's World? No, 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 but thank you. <laughs> thank you for your feedback. Thank you so much, you are out of time. Hey, I'm the poet, uh, if, if people can follow you on. On, on YouTube, Ayama the Poet, okay. Instagram, Ayama the Poet, and Facebook, Ayama the Poet. Exactly. Mm -hmm. uh, my handle on Instagram is Hermes Jr. Facebook, uh, I'm not on Facebook, so, uh, in, uh, what's the other? Twitter, yeah. Twitter is Hermes Nation. Yes. All right. Thank <coughs> you. And that marks the end of the conversation, by the way. Kesha, we have crazy, hilarious surprises for you. You are not ready. You have no idea. It's going to be amazing, Sao Sao. Stick around. So we, we are done, by the way. Have an amazing Monday. My name is Brian Sakwa. See you tomorrow.